Not the thing trying to grab in the wind. I'll stop it and I'll try to land it on a bit more flatter ground. The back is Hi there guys, just a quickie. I've just cleaned all the uh, the drones off. Well, a couple of three of my drones, um, especially the Xeno, had all wasps attacked it and cleaned all the blades off. I cleaned all the blew all the motors out and have oiled the motors. I do it with um, very fine sewing machine oil, and I use an hypodermic needle solely being that it's very fine oil and if you use anything else it actually pours it in so an hypodermic needle like that is ideal and I just get it actually right in the bearings there and do the ones on there the same as the phantom just two little drops down in the bearings the spinning they've all been done this has been done um, three years old everything still, everything still sounds the same never had a problem with it never had a motor failure but that's why I, like I say I oil the bearings I just take the little uh, hypodermic needle and I just put it inside there and two drops give it a spin make sure they're all cleaned off and running fine just be careful you don't stab yourself they think you're a junk else yeah what you find is if you use sewing machine oil that's what I use but any sewing machine oil the fine stuff in an eye, this hypodermic needle if it's too thick it won't come out the needle so and it's just fine, very fine oil, two drops as you well, people say bearings but they're, they're metal to metal bearings, they're not real bearings as such there's no bearings inside the bearings, they're just metal to metal ones but there you go, it proves the point three years old, touch wood, no problems two years old or three years on and I know never had a problem which you very rarely do with phantoms anyway the Xeno I did have one fly away but I think that was totally me leaving it out while I set it up in the sun and it was actually red hot and I think it upset the compass on it and it never done it again even though I did the updates it's never done it again so just a quickie guys there you go the old Xeno I'll tell you what, for the price and the technology in there and the camera is absolutely first class, can't fault it. And where are you going to get a drone from for that price? You know, I mean you get all of the uh, JJRC's ones and you might as well just stick a few extra quid and buy the proper one because like I say the camera's just out of this world so for the price I might add and if you want to pay two thousand pound or a thousand pound it's different but when you're paying two hundred and fifty two hundred and eighty what do you expect there you go another one there from the old one but we're gonna have a fly today I think it's the first day it hasn't rained it's been pouring down rain for three days except for it's a little bit windy and I've got the dog trying to drink water as we speak. Alrighty guys, catch you in a bit. See you later. Bye bye.